Hey, what's up, everybody? It is your boy, Brent. I want to thank you guys for checking out another amazing video today. So today we are shooting with none other than the most fabulous Talia. She came out today. We're going to be doing a sunrise shoot. Now, of course, you might be looking like it's bright. How's it sunrise? That's because we're doing it later on because we wanted to get to the beach and we wanted to hurry up and shoot before the sun fully came up like it is right now, all bright and crap. So now I'm recording the intro. So um, today we're gonna be doing a sunrise shoot. We're gonna be using a variable of amounts of lenses. We're gonna be using the 12 to 24 millimeter 2.8, which is a crazy amount of lens. We're gonna be using the 35 millimeter 1.4, uh, 1.2 from Sigma. We're also gonna be using the 85, the 105, and a lot of different lenses. So I will put them up here as the shots go. But normally when you come to a beach, and depending on how the sunset looks, what the environment is, what you have around you, you never know what type of lens you're gonna use. That's why every time I do a sunset shoot, I always bring a lot of lenses because if those clouds and the sun match, you wanna be able to get all that in the picture and you wanna get a wide, um, a wide angle shot. Um, a lot of times when you wanna get a portrait, but you don't wanna get too close because you want the sun, you want the sunset, but you also want your model, you also want a few things around her, normally you go with an 85. Um, and then sometimes when you actually want to get close and you want to get some really good shots and you want to get those portraits, then you can go as close as a 105 or even a 135. So today we're going to be using all those lenses. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. If you have any questions, make sure you put them in the comment section below and I will see you in the video. Holla! the whole mirror dude <laughs> your makeup and hair is on point what do you need the mirror for Okay guys, one of the most important things about doing a sunrise photo shoot is the placement of your model and where they are in connection with the sunrise. So you want to make sure you place them in a position where you're going to get those really nice oranges and reds in the background. Uh, we're going to start this off using the 85mm 1.4 from Sigma. Check out. Okay guys, so for these next few shots, I had to leave it just slightly elevated above me. As you can see, I wanted to put her on this little hill right here and shoot up at her at an angle to get her, but also get the sunrise um, in the backdrop. And as you can see, she's really at the strongest point of the sunrise, the sun right on her back, and these came out beautifully.
Okay guys, so from here we're gonna go to the 12 to 24 millimeter 2.8 G Master. Now this ultra wide angle lens really allows you to get really good versatility in your pictures. I love shooting wide angle and I thought shooting wide for sunrise photos would be amazing. guys so we're having an amazing time with all the different shots the different angles and the different lenses so now Talia is going to go ahead and get changed into something a little bit more seductive and we're going to be using the 35 millimeter 1.2 sigma art lens which is my favorite 35 millimeter the best 35 millimeter on the planet um, I saw these rocks over here on the side so I decided to go ahead and place Talia on the rocks get some sun behind her but also get a nice aesthetic with the rocks in the foreground and background check it out Okay, one thing you got to be careful for is how fast the sun rises on a sunrise shoot. So I saw how fast the sun was rising. So now I wanted to use the sun as a really good real light to really pop her out of the picture and illuminate her in the background. So check these out. Alright, I had to put the camera down and have Manny hold the softbox because the wind was just so strong. But yeah, we're going to continue to use the sun as a really good backlight um, and really highlight her from the background because it's so strong. The oranges are really nice and they just come created just an amazing image. moving on to our last set with the sun rapidly rising we're going to go ahead and switch to the 105 millimeter 1.4 my favorite portrait lens my bread and butter we're going to use this lifeguard shack here for a good prop and these images came out really nice
I really just love the look of the 105.14, just the way it captures and separates your subject from the background and the way it just renders the picture. It looks absolutely incredible, especially during the sunrise photo shoot. So what we're going to do next is I'm going to use this uh, Garshak still again. I'm going to have Talia sit on the ground to get some more great images of her still using the sun as a really good uh, rim light and backlight on her. Hey, what's up, everybody? Thank you for checking out the video. We are finito. We had an amazing shoot. Um, hopefully, you guys enjoyed those shots, and hopefully, I was able to provide you some tips on how to do a sunrise shoot. I want to thank my amazing. Come here, Talia. She over here with the thing. Uh, I want to thank my amazing model, Talia, for waking up at 5 a.m. with me and coming out here and doing the sunrise shoot. Today is June 18th or 19th? 19th. 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 So, first of all, happy Father's Day to all you fathers out there and also happy Juneteenth to everybody also. Um, hope you guys are having a great day and by the time this video comes out, it's going to be past Juneteenth. So, anyway, we're still going to tell you in the future or the past, <laughs> past to the future. All right. Um, my amazing model, Talia, uh, make sure that you are going to follow her. I know a lot of you guys are following her now and I appreciate it, but just in case you are not following her, this is how you follow her because she does have a new account that she made not too long ago because somebody was doing something stupid. But anyway, here she is. <laughs> yes, Muhammad T6 times two. Times two. And the other one was just T6, right? Yeah. yeah. So we have to do the time. Yeah, so we have to do the times two now. So uh, make sure you guys go follow her. Um, also, if you do not have tickets to our photo walk, it's going to be an amazing time featuring the beautiful Talia. Um, so if all you guys have ever, you always comment on the videos. So if you want to come shoot with her, then get your tickets. And we'll see you at the end. Until next time, comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. We out here. Peace. We out.